God's not real lol. Totes hears a song and dance number about it. Holy shit what the fuck, where did you come from? Let me eat her soul. Fair enough but you have to be my bitch for life. Insert stereotypical black butler filler dialogue here. You know, melodramatic food descriptions, dance lessons, etc etc etc. No. People are dropping that in London for no reason. Sounds like a case for me. CL Phantom Hive? You know, the actual CL Phantom Hive. You're pushing it. Overtime bitch. Fuck. We're the best characters in the Kurashitsuji universe by a landslide. They didn't have my hair. It's me the fan favorite. You're literally not the fan favorite, please shut the fuck up. Fuck me. TBH, you've probably fucked everyone who works here with the exception of Alan and even then who knows. People are dying. Let's make puns. I fucking love puns. Sharp. Jawline. That pun makes no sense in English. Give me information. Sing me a song. If you want a sarcastic joke here, just listen to the lyrics of the actual song. Why did I accept this fucking job? Don't get in my way mad enough at you for convincing Will to let you come along with me. I definitely don't plan on sabotaging this investigation, because I'm hiding a dark secret, and have sacrificed everything I stand for for your sake. What? What? Fuck off, demon. Ah, oh, fuck. Ha 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 ha, you're dying, motherfucker. I mean like they can stay at the Phantom Hive Mansion, if it's convenient for the plot I guess. I never said you could let them stay. Your power over me is an illusion. Who are you? I represent disease and decay and the allure of death la 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 insert opera music. I'm dying Squirtle. Newer and OTTTTTTT. Please stop yes I am. You're not gonna die for a while though. You give me a reason to want to live and make a difference in the time I have left. I can't even make a joke here that's just brutally sad. Time for obligatory comic relief motherfuckers. I fucked Sebastian and there's nothing you Sebastian loving fucks can do about that. Whether anything happened between Krell and I or not, and it's probably an uh, it's important that we acknowledge that Sebastian obviously does not have healthy dynamics, nor is it morally acceptable at all but it is undeniably heavily implied and instead of denying its existence or supporting it as a ship, we have to analyze what Yano Toboso is saying about morality and about Ciel's character and sense of self-worth through the dynamic. Black Butler is deeper than people give it credit for. I mean uh, der shut up Grell insert slur. You're the murderer. Ha 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 ha. Okay yeah. You should probably start running. Eric Kundoshai. I love torturing women la 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 la. How the fuck did you get here? Stop torturing women. No. Just kill them. I take it back I love you let's throw an upper where we kill everyone. Eric you piece of shit. I gotta. You don't gotta. Wait. Okay you just figured it out so I'm gonna start running now. Overtime because Eric decided to kill everyone. God damn it. You're telling me the whole souls of women and children plot only exists for the sake of getting me in a dress? I mean I can't think of any other reason. Why are you wearing a dress too? Comic relief probably. Well I guess nothing is perfect.
la 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 opera music that could have been pertaining to the plot or serving as a symbol, but instead they just picked the most well-known song out there. I'm probably gonna end up getting kidnapped, aren't I? My plans are falling apart, and I need a last resort, so I'm kidnapping you. Incredible. Wow, you actually managed to get kidnapped again. You know, for someone bound to protect me, you seem to be very bad at keeping me from getting kidnapped over and over and over again. The love you think I have for you is an illusion you've constructed in your head and projected onto me because you know nobody in this world loves you. You're so desperate for someone to care about you that you've allowed yourself to fall victim to an evil much more sinister than any human trafficking ring. In fact, my entire character is pretty much just a giant ball of unmitigated malice. Charming malice perhaps, but malice nonetheless. Kick Eric's ass. You got it, bitch. You've been killing people to save my life. Yeah, sorry. You can't kill people anymore that you're still my partner and I'm gonna support you. Okay, I love you. I love you. Hey, we never said that in the actual musical. Technically, we did if you read in between the lines. Die. Literally, this world is full of innocent people and you choose for your last kill to be the kid protected by a literal demon? You're a fucking dumbass. Who said anything about me protecting you? Sebastian, this is not the time for ethics discussion. I'm about to be murdered by an emotionally unstable personification of death. Dice Yale. Wait, you're not CL. And now I'm dead. These flowers represent loneliness. Why? Because. Oh, okay, eight. Eric Sampai, you sure know how to talk big, huh? Almost a full decade later and I still have no fucking clue what that line is supposed to mean. Kill me, I have no will to live. I have a personal policy that involves not killing people who want to die, but for you will make an exception. Insert the single most unattractive dying noise you've ever heard. Well, all the souls raining down from the sky are cool, I guess I'd come not very reactive. They never established how that even happened. Why can't you just let us appreciate one goddamn thing? God, I'm so excited to fucking murder you. This last song is the only song in this musical that has a studio version, probes because it's the only slightly normal number here. I am asleep. You're gonna die, bitch. <laughs> 